Deacon's mission is to lead people into a growing relationship with Jesus Christ. Our core values shape the ways we achieve this mission. This first value of authentic Christianity is crucial because it establishes the end game. It defines what a growing relationship with Jesus Christ looks like so we know where we're heading. It also sets the ideal for us as the leadership of the church. We want to be living an authentic Christian life so we can lead people to authentic Christianity. Every Sunday, the people of Beacon gather for worship. It happens at different times and in different locations, but the result is the same. God is glorified. We are careful in shaping every worship gathering to create an atmosphere where people can meet with God and experience His presence. The lyrics of every song are biblically sound and the music is current and compelling. Traditional liturgical elements like the Eucharist and responsive readings are brought into the services as well. Our hope is that these elements aren't experienced as boring, old, or routine. Rather, we bring new freshness to them. So these age-old traditions once again draw us deeper into the presence of God. As part of Beacon's worship each week, there's also a time of teaching. All of Beacon's teachings are drawn out of the scriptures. We have the gospel, the good news of what Christ has done for us, at the center. It's our hope that these worship gatherings will allow people to experience God in ways that bring lasting life transformation. So worship isn't something that just takes place Sundays. Rather, people embrace a lifestyle of worship where everything they do, say, or think brings glory to God above. We can't talk about Beacon's worship gatherings without talking about the importance of cultural relevance. The truths we hold to are timeless and unchanging, but people and cultures do change. The way we understand and process information is different than it was 2,000 years ago or even 50 years ago. Beacon strives to keep the truth intact and not watered down while finding new ways of communicating it so its original value can be experienced by people in our ever-changing world. Our worship spaces are warm and comfortable, our music is lively and contemporary. The sermon topics and illustrations are current and they apply to real life. We incorporate set pieces and multimedia, whatever it takes to make biblical truth fully accessible to a 21st century audience. Beacon's commitment to cultural relevance extends beyond Sunday morning. Even when we engage the surrounding community, we're careful to do so in ways that people can easily relate to. We strive to create opportunities for people to get to know us that are easy and fun and comfortable for them. Because the people in our community are important to us. One of the ways we reach out to our community is through our postcard campaigns. We consistently blanket our area with postcards that we think are compelling and thought-provoking that invite people to join us for worship or a special event. Another key way we engage the community is through our outreach events. Fall Fun Fest, Christmas Fest, Vacation Bible School, Street Fairs. These are all opportunities to expose people in our neighborhood to Beacon and to the love of Jesus Christ. Countless people have entered into a relationship with Jesus, and it started with something as simple as a postcard they received in the mail or an afternoon spent at Fall Fun Fest. Their lives have been changed by the good news of what God has done for us. These things have been part of Beacon's life since the beginning. Throughout the year, we look for opportunities to meet not only the spiritual needs, but the physical needs of those in our community, in our neighboring towns, and around the world. Beacon organizes food drives, clothing drives, and various other service projects, and we often come alongside other organizations to help Long Islanders who are less fortunate. 
In order to care for those in other parts of the world, we've partnered with missionaries to bring sustainable farming practices to Haiti. For several years, a team of runners from Beacon joined World Vision in a half marathon to raise money in order to provide drinking water to third world countries. These are just a few of the things we've done and we're always looking for more ways to make a difference in our community and around the world. Beacon is a growing community. We are constantly seeing new people in our midst and we strive to make them feel welcome from the moment they walk through the door. We realize when people come to Beacon for the first time, whether it be for an event or a Sunday worship gathering, they're probably stepping out of their comfort zone. We want them to feel at home and comfortable. Our First Impressions team works tirelessly to meet every person, welcome them in, get to know them, and to take a genuine interest in their lives. When people connect more fully to the church, their experience of community is heightened. Attending regularly on Sunday mornings, hanging out after the services to get to know people are, are great ways to connect. Serving in any capacity is a great way as well because bonds are formed when you work side by side with people. We also create what we call connect events several times throughout the year. Game nights, potluck dinners, movie nights, concerts, where people are able to develop relationships with each other. And then there are growth groups. Growth groups are one of the surest ways to enter into true community. Growth groups are, are just small group Bible studies that meet in people's homes throughout the week. When you participate in a growth group, you become part of a small unit of people who are pursuing God together. You share in each other's joys and you help carry each other's burdens. People in a true community are cared for. When people at Beacon are struggling or going through a hard time, we want to be there for them. There's a care ministry at Beacon that sends notes and cards to let people know that they are being prayed for and, uh, and to encourage them. Some of the members of the care ministry make hospital and home visits. Some provide meals for individuals and families who need a little extra help and support because of an illness or an injury, the arrival of a new baby or other circumstances. You don't have to be a part of the care ministry. At Beacon, we encourage everyone to take an active role in caring for others in our church family. Community begins in the home. We strengthen the community by strengthening all of its members, including the children. From the moment a child is born, they're part of our community and we care for them. Beacon doesn't baptize infants. Instead, we do dedication services where the children's family and church commit to caring for that child and bringing them up to know and love God. When kids get a little older, around second grade, they're invited to participate in the first Holy Communion class. For teenagers, Beacon offers a baptism confirmation class. Each of these important milestones mark the spiritual development of kids from birth to adulthood. At the heart of Beacon's ministry to children is Kids Quest. Kids Quest is the ongoing religious education for children. We meet every Sunday during the worship gatherings. Week after week, kids are taken on a wild adventure into God's Word. They learn, they grow, they have fun with kids their own age. As kids get older and enter into their teen years, they become part of Fusion, and Fusion is the student ministry here at Beacon. Fusion comes alongside 7th to 12th graders to help them build a foundation of biblical morals and principles that will follow them into adulthood. Beacon understands the importance of a strong Christ-centered marriage. And so we work hard to teach principles that can be applied directly to our marriages, as well as create an environment where marriages can be strengthened and challenged to be the best that they possibly can be. In order to create true community, everyone needs to contribute. Volunteers are what keeps Beacon running. There are countless volunteers who joyfully serve in every event, worship gathering, and fest. People benefit from serving others. 
Beacon empowers us to serve as volunteers because when we serve in a ministry that speaks to our hearts, we become part of something that's bigger than ourselves. Along the way, it helps you develop humility, selflessness, and enjoy the satisfaction of helping others. Jesus said he came not to be served, but to serve. We're told to go and do likewise. The church is able to accomplish more with more hands doing the work. So at Beacon, we're building people up, not just so they become nice people, but so that there's a heart change and they become active people who are out in the world doing good and bringing restoration and healing wherever they go. Our core values and the ministries they shape, every worship gathering, every growth group, every connect event, every children's ministry or service project, everything that we do as a church is hopefully leading toward real life transformation for people. We call this process of transformation discipleship. And the process begins when you participate in a Sunday worship gathering. But that's just the beginning. You're moved farther along as you connect and you develop relationships with others in the church. Uh, the Alpha Course, which acts as an introduction to the Christian faith, will equip you with knowledge and tools to continue in this journey. You'll continue to mature in your faith by plugging into a growth group. And as you find ways to serve the church and the greater community, your faith is put into action. Before you know it, your life has been changed for good. Everyone is on a spiritual journey. Beacon is here to help you along your journey, so you can become the very best version of yourself. As the old saying goes, the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. It's up to you to take that first step.